Is your home secretly making you sick? I'm Paul Keeley from EcoBuilt, and today we're gonna to walk you through a home that heals in every climate zone. Do you ever feel tired after sleeping or wake up congested or have headaches by midday? Maybe you're constantly adjusting the thermostat or staying away from certain rooms in the house. Because the truth is many homes, whether built in hot, humid or cold climates, are built in ways that are quietly wearing us down. Today we're walking through a passive home, a house that's not just built to conserve energy but to reduce stress on the human body. As we move through this space, I'll show you exactly how the walls, windows, insulation, ventilation all work together so that you can live healthier, no matter where you live. Ever go from sweaty to freezing, walking from one room to the next? In cold places, cold air seeps through floors and windows. In hot places, air conditioning blasts one room while another room feels muggy. Passive houses, you know, use thick, continuous insulation. In cold climates, we're talking R75 walls, R100 roof systems. In hot climates, R45 walls, R65 roof systems. And the house also eliminates all thermal bridging. That means comfort is steady from room to room, regardless of climate zone. So your body can stop adjusting and just relax. In most homes, window surfaces radiate discomfort. Your muscles stay tense while trying to maintain its core temperature. Windows and doors in a certifiable passive house are thermally broken and triple glazed. That means on a cold winter day in Ontario or a hot summer day in California, the inside glass is the same as room temperature. Let's go downstairs. So paired with an insulated, airtight, thermally broken floor slab, the place becomes physically easier to live in. Probably something you don't think much about, but so important. Less tension, less anxiety, greater comfort. So if you use allergy pills year round or even part of the year, the problem might be in your walls. Air in most homes enters through cracks, unfiltered and uninvited. Add mold, volatile organic compounds and pollen to the equation and your sinuses don't stand a chance. Passive houses flip the script. They're airtight and use balanced ventilation to bring fresh air into the home 24 seven with no dedicated exhaust that you would typically see in most conventional homes. Exhaust coming from washroom spaces, kitchen, laundry spaces, Look at this wall. There's no exhaust vent. There's only one, and that's through the dedicated ERV system. You know if having exhaust vents puts the house into negative pressure situation? And if you're in negative pressure, outdoor toxins are coming in. If there's any mold in the building envelope because of not having an open permeable building envelope, all of those toxins are coming into the home and staying inside the house. So protect yourself against that. Build airtight, build open permeable with a dedicated ERV system where there's one single exhaust and one single supply air creating the opportunity to live not only comfortably, but breathing healthy. A passive ERV system, it's like giving your house a set of healthy lungs. Whether you're in muggy Florida or dusty Utah, it works. You breathe better, period. Cardiovascular stress. So if your heart's racing at night, it might not be stress, it might be your house. When your house is noisy, inconsistent, or filled with stale air, your body remains in low grade fight or flight mode. Passive houses are sealed and acoustically insulated. There's no excessive sound of ductwork or cycling HVAC units. Just a stable, calm background that allows your cardiovascular system to actually rest. So whether you're trying to fall asleep in a noisy environment like New York City or wind down in rural Nevada, this environment helps your heart slow down. Mood stress. You might not be cranky. Your house might just be overstimulating your nervous system. 
poor lighting, bad air, and temperature shifts all mess with your mood. Passive House Design prioritizes passive solar gain in cold zones, solar shading in hot zones, and low VOC materials everywhere. You feel more focused, less anxious, and more in control. The house becomes a space that lifts your energy instead of draining it. So if your house takes constant work to stay comfortable, something's wrong. In a typical home, you're constantly reacting, constantly adjusting the temperature up or down, constantly turning the fan on and off, and constantly moving the blinds up and down. In a passive house, the envelope works as a system. The floor is insulated, thermal bridge free. The walls and the roof system are airtight. The windows are climate tuned to the environment. The ventilation system constantly provides fresh air 24 seven with a humidity controlled environment, keeping the toxins outside and moving indoor toxins outside as well. But most importantly, the house is vapor tight, watertight, but also open permeable so that there's no chance of mold. Healthy building envelope equals a healthy indoor environment. So you may have been told a house just needs to meet code, but code isn't designed to keep you healthy. Passive house isn't about luxury or aesthetics. It's about building scientifically so that every component contributes to your well-being. It works in every climate from desert heat to northern cold. If your home doesn't allow you to rest, breathe, focus or heal, maybe it's time to expect more from it. This is what a home can be. And honestly, it's the way a home should be. I'm Paul Keeley from Equable Passive House. Follow us for more. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Tell your friends. And if you want to know how you can build your own healthy home, get in touch with us. We provide a complimentary Zoom meeting to make that happen.